Hi everybody, welcome to Wedding Wednesday. My name is Michelle and I'm the owner of Michaela's Brides Design Studio in Hampton, Virginia. And it is Wedding Wednesday and I will be giving you tips, tricks, and wedding day hacks. So today we are going to talk about the difference between an elopement and a micro wedding. I know that's a new phrase or a new term that you guys have probably been hearing um, being thrown around a lot. So I just wanted to give you guys a quick little video just telling you guys what the difference is between the two. Um, so um, because of COVID-19, a lot of people have been opting to do um, elopements or micro weddings. And micro weddings are pretty much just a very small ceremony, about 20 people, no more than 20 people. Um, but you still are kind of doing the whole ceremony, reception, but everything is just like cut down really, really short. Um, it's also way more affordable uh, than your, you know, average wedding of 120 guests or more. Um, they're usually done in like the evenings in just a couple of hours. Um, everything just kind of, kind of just goes boom, 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 done. Um, and an elopement is where it's just you and the groom, it's the bride and the groom, it's just the couple. Um, and it's usually kind of really quick, kind of, you know, on the fly, spur of the moment type of situation where you and your spouse-to-be just go off somewhere it could be near far most cases a more traditional elopement you guys would kind of like go to um a undisclosed location kind of out of town you know pack a small bag and get married um and it's usually a secret um but now with how you know everything's going i know i've definitely been recommended to my brides if you are a 2020 bride and you have postponed your wedding just do a small elopement just you um and your spouse to be and get married on the date that you would have and then do your big celebration um, a year later um and i got i want to share a story with you guys i always tell you guys a story so um me and my husband we actually did an elopement uh it we did it true and hi penelope <laughs> that's my one year old um but we did it in true you know elopement fashion we um it was almost kind of like a dare so um, my husband was stationed in Florida at the time and I was just, um, we were just talking about the wedding. He was like, you're so concerned about the wedding, you know, let's just get married. And I just said, okay. I said, the next time I'm in Florida, we'll just get married then. That's fine. I said, I, I am really concerned about the wedding, but I, I also really do, you know, I, I, I'm also very much concerned about our actual marriage. And he did not believe me. Um, and I think that he thought I was going to chicken out. And honestly, I thought that he was just talking. So the next time I went to Florida, he was like, okay. He was like, we're going to get married. And I was just like, bet, let's go. Um, and we went, I think, to somewhere in Florida. And they were just like, it's going to take, like, you have to go, then wait a week and come back or do something like that. So I said, well, let's just drive down to the next state and see what they say. We don't have anything else to do. And I thought for sure at that moment, he was just going to be like, no, we're not doing all that. No, he, we drove to the next state. I think we were in Georgia. Um, we just found a little courthouse, got married. I don't even remember what the town was. And then we went to the melting pot because that's my favorite place. And y'all know I love to eat. Um, and it was really fun. And it was just exciting. Um, it was something different, of course. I mean, because you don't just go get married every day. Um, but it was really fun just um having the two of us there and just having that memory um even on our actual wedding day here um in virginia where everyone kind of thought that you know it was that we were getting married we were already married so we were just kind of like laughing about that um to ourselves um, of course my family did not think it was funny anyways <laughs> so that's my little tip for today and my little story that i always like to tell a story all right, guys, uh, I hope you guys have a great rest of your week and happy wedding planning. Bye. Penny, say bye. Now she has nothing to say. <laughs> bye, guys.